As you know, the Fortnite is back on iOS. The disputes are settled. The Epic Games has released Fortnite Mobile for EU users only. But you do not need to worry. Today, I am showing you how to download and install Fortnite Mobile on your iPhone or iPad. No matter if you are inside or outside of the EU, you both can download Fortnite on your updated iOS devices. Before you start, make sure your device is supported to install Fortnite. You can see the supported device information on your screen. Your device must have at least 4 gigs of RAM and must be on iOS 17.6 at least or higher. This includes iPhone 11 and all newer devices. I am showing you on iPhone 14 Pro. For iPad users, you can try on iPad OS on 17 firmware. If it doesn't work, you can update it to the iPad OS 18. Let's start the process of downloading Fortnite Mobile on iPhone. Go to this link given in the description. When you are here, tap on Get Signalus button. You will see this page. Now, one thing you need to keep in mind, at the time of making this video, there is no free method available to install Fortnite Mobile on your iPhone if you are outside of the EU region. A method to install Fortnite with Trollstore is circulating, but that does not work now. The app crashes. But whenever a free Fortnite installation method is available, I will definitely make a video about that free method. So make sure you subscribe to the channel. Moreover, this is one of the economical and safest methods to get Fortnite on iPhone, which costs only 20 USD per year. And in my opinion, it's nothing if you want to play Fortnite Mobile outside the EU. On this page, you need to register your device with the Signalus service. Now tap on click here. It will download a profile. Tap on the allow button. Now go to the settings. Here you can see the downloaded profile. Tap on it and install it. Once it's installed, you will be back to the Signalus website. And here, it will show you the UDID of your device. Once it's done, tap on one year subscription button. Now, for a whole year, you can download different apps you want in the library, which usually are not available in the official app store. Once you tap on the subscription button, it will take you to the payment page, where you need to make the $20 payment. You can use your debit or credit card. After the payment is done, you can see two pages. You will be either on the device registration processing page where you need to wait for 72 hours so your device can be signed with the Apple. Or you will be on the signalus page with the device registration complete message and you will be ready to download Fortnite iOS on your device. In my experience, registration takes some time for iOS devices. It's a quick process done on the iPads. Once your device is registered, open signalus. Tap on this link device button and go through the process on the screen. It will again download a profile which you need to install from the settings. Upon installation, you will be back on the Sinoless website. Here you can see all the apps you can get on your device which you can get for a year and you won't find these apps in the official app store. Now to download Fortnite Mobile. Go to the app library and search for Fortnite. Tap on this and tap on sign app. It will take a little time to sign the Fortnite with the Apple for your device. Guys, if you have made this far in this video and you want a free method to install Fortnite, make sure you hit the like and the subscribe button. Tap on this install app button and it will start installing it on your home screen. As it is being installed, typically apps installed with Sinulus last for a year without any revokes. But if the app revokes, the Sinulus system automatically replaces the older certificate with the new one without any additional cost. Once it's installed, before you can open it, you need to turn on the developer mode from settings privacy and security. From here, you can enable the developer mode and it will require you to restart your device as well. 
In case you do not see the developer mode option, iPad users mostly face this glitch. I already have made a video on how to fix developer mode not showing. You can watch that to fix this issue. The link is below in the description. Once it's done, you can open it and play it. But first, it will install all the resources it needs. It will take some time to download. Then you will be able to play it. Remember one thing. After you have installed Fortnite with Sinulus, later, if a new update comes out from Epic Games for Fortnite, you need to replace the current version with the newer one. The new update could take some time to be uploaded on the Sinulus, then you can have it. The link to Sinulus is below in the description. And yes, if your device has higher FPS settings support, you can change the FPS settings for smooth experience. This is how to download Fortnite on iPhone inside and outside the EU. Make sure you subscribe to the channel for the free Fortnite installation method as well when it comes out. Thank you for watching.